Well, today I'm going to show how to make this animation with ZNG Skater in Blender and let's get started. First we need to download and install the add-on, it is free and can be found on the internet. Go to Edit Preferences Add-ons and enable the add-on. Press A and delete everything. Add curve by the circle, rotate the Y axis by 180 degrees with the RK and enlarge the circle with the SK. Add the camera and rotate it 90 degrees on the X axis. Now move the camera to the edge of the circle. Select first camera, then the circle, right click, parent, follow path. In the curve settings open the path animation tab and set the number of frames of your animation. The camera moves in the circle and we can look at the object from different sides. Press Shift A and add text. Press Tab and we can write text. In the text settings we have to change left to center, choose a font, change the size to 2 and experiment with the extrude and depth values in the geometry tab. Then we select the text and click Object, Convert, Mesh. We rotate the text 90 degrees on the X axis, press Ctrl A all transforms and right click set origin to geometry. Move the text along the Z axis to the center. Select the text and add the Remesh modifier. Change the voxel size parameter to 0.008, turn on smooth shading and apply the modifier. Press in and open the add-in tab and install the desired assets. Then select the object and click on the icon with the books. We select any planes we like and click on the their name. We can choose the level of detail of the planes and we can choose the presets. I will leave everything default and click on the scatter selected. We go to the scale tab and in the first frame change the value to 0 and set the keyframe with the I key. Then go to the middle of the animation and change the value for example to 0.7 and put the keyframe. Go to the end of the animation and again change the value to 0 and set the keyframe. Go to the first tab and we can increase the density parameter. I change the parameter to 500 and my computer starts to slow down. I will hide the particle system from the viewport. Again we go to the first frame and add another plane type. Again we change scale to 0 and set the keyframe. Go to the middle of the animation and change the scale for example to 1.2 and set the keyframe. Go to the last frame and set it to 0 again. For this plant you can change the density parameter to 25. And let's add the last plant. In my case I wanted to add ivy. Repeat everything for parameter scale but change the value in middle for example to 6. We can also rotate and change the plans, but in this case it doesn't matter. I don't want to make a lot of ivy, so I will set the density value to 5.
raise the bottom window up and change time length to shade editor. Change the type to vault and I will show how to make the vault lighting with a black background. In environment texture we have to open any HDRI map. You can find HDRI maps for example on HDRI Heaven. Change shade editor to timeline and I want to show how the particle systems look together. And at the end change heavy to cycles. Thank you for watching, set a like, write a comment, well with you spunk, see you in the new videos.